Bills. What's happening? It's your boy Belly D. Williams up in the building. I got space right here. You know, you know, we this is the off the script podcast show with the, the bag and us crew. We in the building. How about you? What's happening, black man? man? Same old, same black man. It's gonna be the first uh video that we didn't did. So hey, let's make this nice. Hey, you know they say if we mess up, we can fix it in post though. I guess. We ain't <laughs> fucking up. Hey, I'm just uh, right, damn. I was just <laughs> <laughs> We got to bleep that one Right But uh, Okay I forgot about YouTube My bad Yeah so You know what I'm saying Hey it is what it is At the end of the day So Dog my brother What you got in the cup Oh Bombay Oh you got the double cup going on Yeah definitely You the man You the man You the man A little bit of gin here A little bit of orange juice there Dog man I ain't been paying attention to the news man But you know what I'm saying I don't know Um, I got a letter from the governor the other day Huh You know Oh wait what? Wait, I'm, I'm, you got a letter from the governor? Yeah, I got a letter from the governor the other day. Why, 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 why did you get a letter from the governor? Because she, she, she said it's time for me to get my stack right. Oh, you got your stimmy? No, I ain't getting no stimmies, but she just said it's time for me to get my stack right. Right, because I ain't thinking So if stimmies. a bitch don't act right, that hoe on the next flight. You know what I'm saying? Oh, God. <laughs> yep, you two going to have a problem with us. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying though, you know what I'm saying? Don't worry about don't worry about the YouTube algorithm. I, I'm, I'm gonna put a bell on it or something. Every time I drop a cuss word, bing. Oh yeah, we're gonna need a good drink for this night. <sighs> I'm just saying. So No, but that was from Chic Loose album. I can't remember which album it was from. Who? So from the locks. From the locks. The third third member of the locks. Chic uh, Loose. Oh yeah. Yeah, I dog. I was bumping yeah. after taxes the other day. Oh my god. Uh, a lot of people don't know about the After Taxes album, though. I mean, look, I, don't, I didn't know nothing about the third person from the locks, to be honest <laughs> with you. <laughs> you told me the first two. I'm like, yeah, yeah. And then it was like, who's that third one? Ah, uh, you got me. Dog, real talk, though. He dropped some of the best albums out of the three, though. To me. And I don't even know this guy's name. Like, I'm a little bit... I'm a little bit messed up. Because like, you got Jada Kiss, yeah. Styles P, uh-huh. and Sheik Luch. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? When he dropped the uh the silverback gorilla, straight fire. The silverback silverback, silverback, silverback gorilla. gorilla dog. Oh my bad, I was thinking gorillas in a mess. My bad. No, we ain't talking about the yeah, lynch we mob. We ain't doing the lynch mob. My bad. Oh man, man we ain't we ain't talking about yeah, the he mob. Made the mob was the, gorilla, the silverback gorilla. Yeah, the silverback. Like, you know, the, 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 that was the biggest gorilla though. Is the silverback though? That's the most dangerous gorilla. That's what I'm saying though. Yeah, he dropped the silverback. I'm like, oh, this is fire. Wow. It's like somebody pulled gasoline, just lit a match, and throw some propane on top of it. Ooh. Dog, I'm like. <sighs> propane and propane accessories on top of the fire. <sighs> Man, like King of the Hill, though. You know okay. what I'm saying? I guess uh, I'm going to have to go check out this album because I don't know nothing about it. Dude, that. the After Taxes album was fire. He, I don't know which one came first. It was the After Taxes or the Silverback. But then the killing part about it is, you know, you, you mostly New York hip hop, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm mostly hip hop. <laughs> New York hip hop sometimes have missed me. Even dog, we got Dipset and the Locks. Wait, 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 wait! I know the first name. Uh, Cameron. Okay. Jim Jones. Uh, okay. Cameron, Jim Jones, and Jewel Santana. I, I think Max B was on there too. But dog, put all three, all four of them together. Then on top of Ass Styles, Pete, Jada Kiss, and Sheik on one song. Oh my, Jesus. That month, dog. And you know what's bad? I'm gonna tell you about out of that whole crew. Uh, it's only two in there I like, and that's Jada and Styles P. 100. I gotta be honest. I'm not. I'm. I'm. I like hip hop more than smooth hip hop. They they stuff got kind of out there. So mm-hmm. you give me Styles P to get high songs. Yeah, you give me Jada. You give me Jada. Hey, I love that guy. You know what I'm saying? 100. He he he. I hey, he know what a thug about. 100. So I, I love that guy, but. Yeah, I ain't gonna everybody lie. else is not your taste, right? Not everybody in my taste on that crew on that whole flavor right there. Like, I respect it though, because you know what I'm saying, dog. But I love the after taxes. I, I can't. Uh, it's not streets is talking. I can say this: Jada make me want to bust people head open after I listen to him. What? Yes, yes. I don't know, dog. Man, to me, you ever listen to what a thug about like on repeat, dog? <laughs> don't don't be in a ride. Don't be in a ride at midnight listening to what a thug about at midnight, man. Nah, you doing something to somebody somewhere. I'm <laughs> no, man. Look, let me tell you, Jada Kiss. To me, to me, just this is me personally. Jada Kiss is one of them smooth motherfuckers, man. 
Smooth. He's smooth as fucking butter. Wait. He is slick talking smooth, motherfucker. He like one of them niggas you know that got a knife in his pocket. And you don't even realize he got a knife in his pocket, but he already didn't cut you before you even realize it. That's the type of motherfucker how Jadik his flows be coming off. You be up there like, yeah, this shit's sweet. This motherfucker. Did this motherfucker just cut a nigga? Like, yeah, wait a okay. minute. I got you. I got you. You know what I'm saying? To me, it's almost like when you say it like that, and that's like listening to uh, Ghostface Killer. Ghostface was, he was say, go either Ghostface or Raekwon. They would say things in such a wild ass way that. It'll make you go back and be like, wait a minute, he just described doing what with what? Oh, wait, man! So look, I got th- you. Th- that, that's that's ghost because you know he the only he the only man that can come around in the hood with an eagle on his arm, though. Yeah, he yeah. he he rocking a roll with an eagle. Yeah, yeah, that's that guy. Then you let him before Corona, you let him come walk up in your establishment with a ski mask on, and it's no problem. Absolutely, he just like. Hmm. Okay <laughs> That's ghost Leave him alone You right. know what I'm saying But <laughs> see the thing about it is The locks That's how Jada Kiss is to me Styles P is just He up front Just tell you how He up front But wants you to think about What he about to do to you Before he do to it yeah, Before he, he do he, it to he, you He's gonna tell you What he about to do Yeah, And he gonna give you An opportunity to think about The outcome of the situation Yeah But my man Sheik It's like this I got a baseball bat And we ain't talking I'm swinging Mm. I'm just walking in the room. Boom! You on the ground. Oh, it's no, it's yeah, no, yeah, no yeah, second thought. It's yeah. no thought, no process. Wow. Just open it. You walk the door, open up. Bam! You on the ground. That's it. That's all. Uh-huh. So, Seek was just blunt with his though. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Got you. Got you. Yeah. I might have to get up on that one. Definitely. I might have to get yeah, up he on like, that. Yeah. I don't one. know. Like he had he had this one line. He was talking about. He had mentioned Jay Z. He was like, "Jig ain't go platinum until it's third." So and he was talking about going into he because all his albums went his first album didn't go independent, but he sold like two maybe three hundred thousand. All right, he was like, if I would have went independent on my first album, we'd be sitting back paid right now. Yeah, I might have to get up on this guy, dude. <clears throat> and you know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't realize though. You know what I'm saying? When it comes down to certain kind of music, dog, I love this shit. I love it. I see. I see. You got you know a hell saying? of a passion for it. Where I can't even fuck with it. I ain't gonna. Man, YouTube man. man you you can't fuck with it You can't fuck with it Fuck it I told you I'm gonna put the bleeps in there I got it <laughs> Shit Bleep 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 Right this whole This whole video for Bleep 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 Hey bleep 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 Shit I'm probably gonna put a macaroni mixing sound in there Wow Don't do that Especially, especially don't, when Don't don't Shush <laughs> Shush Shush Stop before you start Stop what, before what? you start Ain't no kids around here today I don't so. a damn Watch it Let's, let's be nice for the people at, for the very first fucking video. I tried. I tried to say the shit with a straight face. Yeah, okay. <laughs> fuck. Shit. Motherfuckers listen to our shit. They know what the fuck's finna go down. Pretty much. Shit. Finna go down like a hooker on prom night. What? You know somebody bought some pussy on prom night. So I, I, I'm just kind of like, damn, you went to prom and still had to pay for a prostitute? Like, who the fuck does that? You know what? I, I can name three know. I don't even want that graduated know. this I, year. Could you know? What I'm saying? I, I, that's fucked up. That's <laughs> just saying. Like, damn, you had to pay for the prom, pay for the fucking tickets, the and your outfit, and a, and a prostitute. That's just. I'd rather. <laughs> damn. Yeah. No. Do you want me to be PC or no PC? Because I'm gonna tell you like this. You mean PG? No, nah, PC. Politically correct. Because PC, why are we doing? Okay, cool. We doing PC? Because check this out, check this out. Wait, 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 hold, wait, 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 wait. I had to think about this. I had to think about this. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I had to think about the format we on. Wait a minute. Let's go PC for now. Let's stay PC. First show. Come on. Let's let's. Now you, you, we can't. Now have, if yeah. you dealing with a particular type of young lady, okay, and you have to, you ask her to prom. Mm-hmm. You buy her dress. Okay. The corsage flower uh-huh. thing. You get you a rental. Mm-hmm. You take her to prom. Mm-hmm. 
You think you gonna you supposed to get a little squeaky squeaky at the end of the night? Not necessarily, but I I feel like you feel like you're entitled to after. All How do you that feel? How, don't no don't don't me in that category. I, I'm, I'm just I'm just from the way you put it out there. It's like no one's entitled to anybody on that level. Like no, nah, you ain't necessarily gonna get no squeaky. But here's my thing. That is pretty Ex- much expected. A, eh, yeah, it's expected. Unfortunately, but. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. Like, let's be 100. Like, okay, just because you take a woman out, that don't mean she got to get draws on no level. Absolutely. Not, 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 not if she likes you and that was already the plan, and then, hey, maybe that is. But some things like that need to be discussed before. Hold on, 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 hold on. Maybe, maybe you misunderstand what I'm saying. No, no, hear what no, I'm no, saying. No, no, hear no, no, saying. no, I understand what you're saying. I, I didn't pour out all the money, and I feel like, you know, oh, yeah, I did that, but I, I'm, again... If my game wasn't good enough in the first place to talk on it before I even took her out, then spending the money wasn't going to help. Look here. Let me play devil's advocate. All right. Matter of fact, I play devil's advocate every show. Yeah, we know. So I just want to be clarified when I say this. So people won't really cancel culture me right. today. Come on, um, Billy. Come on, Billy. Look, if I buy you a pack of gum. Hey, just let y'all know, I am not Belly D, in case y'all couldn't tell the difference. (laughs) (laughs) Fucking asshole. (laughs) See... You know what? I'm not in shit this time. The first video is going to be un un um sponsored, so fuck it. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> fuck it. I'm going to give some free plugs in before the night's over. Oh, you going to get us kicked off of YouTube already before we get on good. Yeah. <laughs> fuck it. I got to build a fan base up first. That's what she said, too. Oh, so. <laughs> but no, 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 no. Serious, all bullshit. No. Devil's advocate point, right? You know what I'm saying? Okay. Let's play devil's advocate. If I if I buy you a pack of gum, uh-huh. I expect a hand job. If I take you to the movies, I expect a, a, a tug upon a, a pun of the popcorn. You know what I'm saying? So, if I do anything for you, I want to reach around. <laughs> Stop looking at me like that. I'm trying to get my point out. I'm trying. <laughs> like, dog. Like, you is, dog, you, damn. I mean, I'm managed, but God, man. Go ahead. No, 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 I'm saying. I expect that. That's what you expect I expect it to happen Something uh, Touch the tips Put some spit on your hand And rub it Something I expect it But do it happen all the time No Should I force it No I want to be clear about that Don't force shit Right You can expect anything Got you then but you can't force it Right And sometimes you be Setting yourself up With dumbass expectations too. You be fucking around Looking like Tyson In handcuffs Pretty much You know what I'm saying Fuck that then if you really fucked up in the mind, you're gonna be like OJ and shit. Ooh. You know he was none of that. You know he was into if he ain't getting what he wants, he's stabbing for his. Dog. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, he he like he had a he had a moment like the Mendez brothers mad at his parents for some money and shit. What? I just ain't heard that name in about twenty years. Dog. Shit, they they they, come, just, they supposed to be coming home, off, right? What? Yeah, the Mendez brothers got did their time. They get to come home. They get to come home. Yeah, they didn't get life. They didn't get natural. They got the twenty five. Whoa, I. I'm just saying it's whoa. not. It's not like I didn't mention the Dupont situation. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying that. Damn, they coming home. You get a chance to come home. Everybody gets a chance to come home unless you got natural life. Yeah, it's like Larry Nevers and Walter Butts. Like Esau said, they was in prison sucking on nuts and took the broomstick up the butt. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. I'm getting way off track. Yeah. I'm getting way off track yeah, for what, really I was, what I was. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. My whole point was making. Well, you That's know what I'm saying? You can expect things. Yeah. That don't mean you're going to win. Donald J. Trump expected to win the White House again. Well, but according to him, he still won. They, they, according to them, they, they somehow. They, according to him, they, his wife still love him too. But we know the truth about that shit. That bitch got that help me face going on. Help me. He look. She up there looking like one of the kids on the milk carton. Have you seen me? Oh, Donald, please let me go home. Okay, Donald, I'll just roll over. Have fun. Oh yeah, y'all my lean up. Yeah. Oh, okay, you're done. You're done. Okay, I'm going to my room. So you do. You through. You done. 
Are you done to get through? Right. Fuck around, pull a baby and shit. Are you done to get through? <laughs> Man, I saw a picture to him of him in the um in the studio too when he was doing it. He looked like he was having a he was having a temper tantrum with his arms crowded. Oh, and you, folded. Never, you never saw that video? I saw the video. I just saw that one part. I didn't see the whole oh, video. Man, I though. saw the whole video when it happened because I couldn't understand what the whole everybody was talking about. And I was like, what? What's going on? So I had to actually watch the whole video, and I was like, wow. So he actually. Wait, so he actually went to a radio station to clown on the DJ, and I ain't gonna lie, who was that? Uh, uh, Charlemagne the God, right? He gonna tell my man. He told my man, say, "Oh wait, 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 you gonna come up in here? And I'm just on the radio." He said, "Man, you gonna clap at me?" But there's motherfuckers out there talking about taking your head off, and you ain't saying one word. But I'm a radio host. Mm. <laughs> I'm just look, dog. Look, look. Check this out. I don't know Birdman. I don't know Baby. Whichever one he going by or broke ass nigga nowadays. Right. You know what I'm saying? Look, PBS. Me- <laughs> I motherfucker still probably got more money than me, but probably still. So. Look, dog. I shouldn't say this, but I'm gonna say it. He had one of the baddest females walking this face of this earth, and that's Tony Braxton. Tony Braxton may be a, a thousand years old. I think she still be one of the baddest mama jealous walking face of the earth. How you jack that up though? That's the question. That's the question. That's like um jacking up Angela Basket. Uh, ba- oh, shit, that was wrong. Duh. That was wrong. Oh shit. <laughs> mm. We didn't turn her into a piece of uh, uh something useful to put in your closet. Angela Bassett. Bassett. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, okay I fucked that up That was mine uh, I mispronounced her name But she fine in the motherfucker They oh, say she's she like 60 something years old Yeah though. Yeah <laughs> She's still fine Yeah, yeah. Just like um, I hate to say like I'm, I'm gonna say somebody like She's not How do I put it This woman is beautiful to me I can't say sexy Okay But like Felicia Rashad She's beautiful Felicia Rashad Oh, okay. Kazi's wife. Right. Okay, that's where I know her from. Yeah. Pl- man, she man. Yeah. I seen some of the newer movies, dog. Yeah. Man, See? she 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 got some rage though. Right. You See? know what I'm saying? That's like uh mm, 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 Yeah. Uh-huh. Knee along, dog. Oh my god. Ooh. Make your boy shiver a minute. Ooh. Like you got Knee along, you got Megan Good. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Look, we can go down some. Mm. Okay, hold on, man. Hold mm-hmm. on, man. Hold on, man. My hold on, good. Hold on. Man, you got to turn that fan up in a minute. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Woo! Hold Let on, your boy. Damn. I'm telling you. Woo! Then, who was who, another one? What's old girl name? I can't. Uh, 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 From what? Oh, uh, Gabrielle Sinai Union? Lathan. The Ga- what? Gabrielle Union? Hell, fuck no. What? Gabrielle Union? No, dog. I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. I, really? I, I, no, I can't. That's 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 no. What did man. something change since the Jamie Foxx show that I ain't see? I mean, yeah, okay, must have. Jamie I mean, Foxx show. Yeah, she wasn't on Jamie Foxx show. What's the lady on? Um, no, nah, Gabrielle Union's not not the uh, Francine on Jamie Foxx. No, show? who's the chick on uh, Jamie Foxx show? I cannot think of her name, but that's not the same person, bro. Bring it on from um from Bring It On. That's Gabrielle Union. Never seen Bring It On. Uh. I'm sorry, I'm not into the LA's finest. Dwayne Wade's wife. Um crickets. Hit the crickets. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, because. I thought at the end of Jamie Foxx show that was Gabrielle Union. That, no, that was not looking. That's not I, Gabrielle Union. That's, that's not, not Gabrielle Union. No. That's, that's making me messed up. Becoming Mary Jane. Okay, you're not into. I smoke recent. Mary Jane. I don't know about becoming Mary Jane. I know I am what I smoke, but I'm not Mary Jane. I thought you are what you eat. That's why we call you a pussy all the time. A so. little bit of that too. Hey, I'm, <sighs> call me pussy weed. Fuck it. Pussy willow weed. <laughs> Couldn't think of nothing else. <laughs> <laughs> Got to be more careful. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! Uh yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Now you got me curious because I'm trying to think uh, who the young lady name is. Now she's fine as hell too. 
Uh, shit. Uh, you know what, man? But I don't know. It's just me. But to me, I seem like Gabrielle Union plays the same character in all her shows. It's like the angry black woman, though. Oh, sort of like a cookie. Uh, Ka- yeah, kind of. Yeah, yeah kind of yeah. like that. But she, but she didn't. She, she. To me, she developed some range. My bad. Because I didn't she didn't done say cookie. I, I apologize. I know that's, that's not what her name. everybody know her from. Yeah, I know that's not her name. I know her name, and I can't think of it right now. But yeah. Because cookie is what I smoke too, so stop plugging cookies on eight mile with the blue with the blue and white looking like cookie monster though. Get high. Okay. I told you we're gonna do some free plugs today. We gonna we gonna free plug that one. On eight mile and mile where they always got the, that line right there on the right hand lane. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, cookies, that's a free plug for y'all. Okay. I'm done. I'm done with y'all. <laughs> Yeah, man, up there looking like Cookie Monster colors and stuff outside. You know what I'm saying? Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Oh, okay, that's crazy. but um, yeah, but uh, I'm here in Detroit. And it's still poor reception. This is crazy. Taji P. Henson. Taraji. Taraji. I said Taraji. Taraji. Yeah, I'm Taraji. thinking about motherfucking Muppets. God damn it. Wow. My fucking mind is off today. I am yeah. off, man. Yeah, I see, man. But yeah, it's Raji P. Henson. Yeah, my bad. She find a motherfucker too. Yeah. 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 No, I can say this. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I just wish she was a little bit thicker for me. Just a little bit thicker. Hey, you wish everybody was a little bit thicker. No, nah, not everybody. Nah, oh, nah, I can say, like, for honestly. Regina King ain't got to gain a, a ounce. A fucking ounce she at ain't all. Gain God nothing, damn, man. she got range. She's so sexy. Man. man. Like, I don't care. She go all the way back from 227 to now, man. She's sexy. I don't care. That's I'm like a, Jill Scott, man. Oh, man. Sexy. Sexy. Man, but I was watching, so I was watching some YouTube channel, and it was talking about Jill, 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 Jill Scott's life and relationships and stuff. Yeah. And I'm looking at, they say, alleged some of the stuff. I don't know. I'm going to just say alleged. She said, they said she did some. Dude's wrong. Wow. But, uh. Wow, that sounds kind of odd. Hey, give me a weekend. Do me wrong after that. I'm saying. Pretty much. Do me wrong and do me right at the same time. Pretty much. Ooh, wait. That's it's bad because, well, I mean, you I still guess. still ain't found Gabrielle Union yet? No, nah, I'm still looking for the Jamie Foxx show actors. Oh. Yeah. That's like a what was it? Vivica Fox. Ooh, eh, she, she, all right. she was all right. She was all, she right. all right. I ain't gonna lie. She wasn't exactly. Oh, it's Garcelle Bouvier. Garcella Bouvier. Oh my bad. Yeah, because I was gonna say you way off, bro. Uh, was the G A. The G A. Nah, I looked at the show for years, but okay. So it's Garcella. B e a u u u v a i s. Anyway, moving on to the next subject. Bouvet. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Look, you know I got a phone call the other day though. Okay. From the black Mitch McConnell. Oh man. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I knew we was we was waiting for. Yeah, the black Mitch McConnell called me up and left a message, man. You know what? Um, can 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 we go over that message right now? You want? Oh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, here we go. Yeah, the black Mitch McConnell What's came. What's going through. on, Senator Mitch McConnell of the great state of Kentucky, Bluegrass? I want to discuss on your podcast, Billy D. What's going on with the pandemic relief money? It seems to me that urban communities are spending the money. On Alaskan crab legs, lobster tails, expensive gym shoes, and belt buckles. They don't want to get to work because they're making more money on their black asses. I can say this. I understand. I also understand the pitfalls of the African-American man. It's not only the police that he has to deal with, but more so, it's the black woman. I understand somewhat. But in the great state of Kentucky, you got to understand something. 
we pull ourselves by the bootstraps. Mm-hmm. We get to work. Right, right. Because America believes in work. That's, yes, we do. Yes, we do. The hard work pays off. Something that a lot of people in urban communities just don't understand. What do you mean? Billy D, the American people are being taken for a ride. Mm-hmm. I want to change things. Okay. I want to get this done. But I need a dance partner to say it. Hmm. Let's talk about the situation so now we can change things. Okay. Let's make it happen. Okay. Mitch McConnell, Republican leader of the Senate. Get at me, bro. Man, dog, I got that phone call the other day. <laughs> no bullshit. It kind of <laughs> fucked me up, though. It kind of fucked me up because okay. I'm sitting here like, why the fuck is Mitch calling me? I'm seeing. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm a little bit <laughs> thrown, thrown the hell off with that one. Dog, okay, like, I just said, look, hey, but you know what? Fuck it. I, I, I understand 80% of what he's talking about, though. I understood about 10. I understood about 80% of what he's talking about because. Damn, Kentuckys. God damn it. I don't fuck with Alaskan crab and shit. Fuck around, catch hives and shit. Passing the fuck out, dying slowly. I like him from Maine. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. The bomb base starting to work. This sweet Jesus, <laughs> sweet Mother Mary. This motherfucker gonna say he like his crabs from Maine. I don't like crabs at all. You know what I'm saying? Shit. I don't know about you. Good, cause uh, your boy don't mess with crabs. Yeah, guess what? I eat them all the time. I told you about eating that bad pussy. It See, talks again, to you. I don't fuck with body lice. <laughs> fuck what you talking? I was just <laughs> <laughs> hell. You said you like crabs. Yeah, I like crabs. Crust. I like the crabs that come out of the ocean, not body lice. Hey, I'm just saying. Fuck where I had crabs in your mustache and shit. See again, you up in your flavor no, 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 saving the ones, shit. I, the ones I eat are way too big. Again, bigger than your hand. Nah, nah. We oh, know, hey, we, teach we, us we, on. I'll, no, I'll we're not dealing with the microscopic, um, microscopic little creep, 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 creepy crawlies that's been. Nah, I don't. As a matter of fact, I never seen them little fuckers. I heard about them though. Heard, yeah, I heard about them. Don't no nothing though. As a matter of fact, they almost seem like a fucking urban, ur, ur, um, urban, urban legend. legend. Yeah, because I I've heard about them and I've been like, oh, I've never seen them. I don't want to see hey, them. Hey, remember, remember a few years back, though? How, you talk about urban legends. You know what I'm saying? They came up with that shit called Blue Waffle. Oh, yeah. Dog. Yeah, dog. That Blue Waffle shit had me messed up. What the was called? Hey, man, you heard that Blue Waffle? Blue Waffle? Is that like some um, Lego My Ego shit or something? That's what I thought at first, too, man. You know what I'm saying? So I get to look at that shit like, that don't look right. That looks a little way to me. Yeah, that then, looks a little. Then, then. You know what? That's bad because I did actually see that once. That kind of had me like, whoa, that ain't what they said it was, but I don't know what that is, and you need to leave. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not even going nowhere near that. That doesn't look kosher. Oh, man. Better put some salt on that shit. Uh, straight. Just need to leave. Dispose of. <laughs> yeah, man. But anyway, yeah. About the stimulus packages and stuff. Yeah, you know they say they talking about the I, they say the IRS is supposed to be sending out a few more million dollars and stuff. Yeah, you know I actually got a letter the other day. It's like you said, you got a letter. I got a letter from the who was it? One IRS? of the three. Yeah, Treasury? One, yeah, we, yep. One of them, one of them three letter people. <laughs> yeah, there might have been an IRS saying that's going to send another stimulus check soon, and I'm like, wow. And I'm not saying I'm not turning it down. Right, I am a little bit. Skeptical, very to where I'm kind of wondering. Okay, that's cool and all. I I was appreciative of the first one and the second one. The third one was a little help to help me move, but now it's kind of like okay. Um, I you know just being a good wise American, I keep feeling like there's something on the back end of this. Like, hmm, y'all giving me too much money. You know what it is? What's that? Well, they can't tax it. So I thought that they couldn't tax. You're right. They can't tax it, but you know what they're doing? What what is they doing? They they can get that loogie together for prom night. Mm. Mm. Gonna get you right. Mm. Cause you know what? I'm glad I didn't take out one of them PPP 
Loans. You right. and me both, brother. Right. I'm straight. <laughs> right. Don't PPP me. Right. I'm straight. But out. you know what though? A lot of people been big balling hard with them PPPs. I see. I heard. No, you're like <laughs> you I can't. I can't. Hey, 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 up there. They caught up. <laughs> Dog, remember I was telling you the other day about um, you know I be watching Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, right? Uh, that stuff, come on. Yeah, Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, come on. Yeah, I be watching it, dog. Especially with my man, uh, especially with old girl Cardi Red or something. I think it was Cardi, whatever. You know what I'm saying? What's Her that? fiance, uh, Mo or something. This mo, this mother lover. <laughs> it's so funny about this mother lover, right? Yeah. He had a trucking business. It went out of business. Okay. Let's, let's say a year or so ago. All right. He applied for a PVP loan. Okay. The, before he, the business went out of he went out of business before the pandemic. Oh. So they cut the man the check for the money. For the business. Yeah. That so he no longer Yeah. Had. Yeah. <laughs> so Big right. Baller came through with a brand new Bentley. Huh? Stutting hard. Oh, wow. I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? Look, handle your business, bro. You gonna get your business back up and running? Cool, I'm with it, hundred percent. Do your but thing. You buy a Bentley, like for tax purposes. Is that? What? I don't know. That, That's some new shit to wow. me. Like so, he come through with the, then. You know what I'm saying? Check. You know how dumbass Kwame got caught up with his cell phone. Oh God. Yeah. Check this out All some bullshit jumped off I don't yeah. know all the details But some bullshit jumped off all The right. motherfucker in court right Yeah They tell him He gotta go home and Get his affairs in order Alright Okay I'm going away For about a year or two Okay Fuck it It is what it is Yeah it's a year or two It's meatball This mother lover Go On his personal cell phone To say What countries do not have extraditing extra treaties. Oh my god! By the time old boy got to the crib, oh man, them jump out boys like, oh, you going back? You don't oh, get no wow. more bail this time. You don't wow. get a chance. Because wow. we said we know you're running. Wow. No, I mean, look, homeboy, lawyer, let me see your phone. No, I mean, it's <laughs> not even my thing. Hold on, see, here, here's my issue. You got a meatball and you trying to run that? I'm sorry. YouTube, forgive me, but pussy. Motherfuckers, motherfucker, real motherfuckers do that or standing on their head a year or two? That's a gun charge. Like, duh, that's. You can't do that? What you scared? Like, what you finna get? You scared? Scared of dropping the soap? Yes. What you scared? You scared they're gonna really bend you over? I mean, like, yes. oh, you should have your money work for you then. You pay niggas off in that. You should have you a paid lawyer First and foremost You I probably mean, do it like a, Three days Either way it go Even if you did Just a year or two I mean that's That's like uh, Wayne it, did it It builds character Man as bad as that to say I mean a year or two it Ain't gonna really build No real It can character. build his rep up I did mm-hmm. hard time Nah nah nah, <laughs> nah 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 No But I'm a just year, saying though A year or two Don't give you no rep Sorry it gave, it gave, He got a rep now yeah, for it did. It does stupid. give him a rep. Yeah, it gave him that, a rep. Okay, and that way, dumbass, trying to run for a two year bit, man. That's uh, see, you know what? I'm gonna say this 100. Nah, if you trying to go to a country to not be extradited for a one to two year bit, you deserve to get caught. No, that's like my man from um, Girls Gone Wild. You know, that motherfucker, motherfucker bust up and moved to Mexico for a bunch of damn speeding tickets. Speeding tickets. Yeah, you know I'm I'm rich. If you would have said under I'm age rich now. Something. No, I ain't no under. It was, all, everything was completely legal across the board. But I got money. I can do what I want to. Or he doing the Justin Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> he doing the Bieber bro. Yeah, <laughs> that mother lover. Right. So he just so so they just they they, they now they just want to do the white privilege thing. I'm gonna make all the tickets I can and. I ain't I gonna pay no um, one and then move to Mexico. I couldn't make it to court, Your Honor, because we had a family gathering in the Hamptons. What? Yeah. I. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's what stopped all the girls on wild videos. So he bust up and moved to Mexico. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm having a brain on you, Rizzo. <laughs> don't get me wrong. I mean, <laughs> damn. That just, I mean. Don't get me wrong, I wasn't even into that girl's going wild shit. That was the biggest bunch of bullshit I ever saw. Like, I mean, I was like, I think I was a young team when that shit came out. You know, when I was a young team. It was like, ooh. Then I actually got to see the shit and was like, mm, 
this is bullshit. Like, this is, ain't even softcore porn. This is just... They, it ain't even Skinamax at 10 o'clock, man. Right. Fuck, man. It was like, dog, I see better shit from crackheads on fucking Mac Van Dyke and fucking 9 o'clock at night. Like, <laughs> I just seen them do way more than that. <laughs> and that's when I was 14. Like, nah. <laughs> Like uh, I could look outside my window and see them throwing up their fucking uh, shirt for, for just woo yeah yeah go downtown and do the summer shit. all right that's all day so hey give me my cherry beats for right. what right right pretty much like please yeah. stop no don't please. Right. <laughs> stop please I beg you put the deflated puppies back in especially you know what I'm saying some of these young chicks dog I don't like bashing women I'm gonna be completely honest I don't. But some of y'all make the shit too fucking easy. So. Oh, you mean like Trump? <laughs> or the former president? Because he made shit way too easy. He didn't make it easy. He just said, grab him by the pussy. Fuck him. It's my pussy. I'm grabbing this shit. Give me this pussy. He was like he was like the president scorpion. Get over here. Just grabbing the bitch by the pussy. Like, bitch, this my pussy. That motherfucker was chest and cheat on the nigga said it ain't easy being cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> Grab him by the pussy. What? <laughs> Grab him by the pussy. Dog, he still got elected by 40% of the women in America. You know what I'm saying? But if I say grab that bitch by the pussy, I'm gonna get canceled. Lock that motherfucker I, up. You know what? That's what I do not understand about my country. I've grown up here. I'm in my mid forties, and I still don't understand this shit. Like, dog, when the former president, <clears throat> current, he's still current president. Yeah, he's yeah. just not doing his job. He's right, just chilling right, right now. Right, he's taking a break. Uh, when, when, he's when, golfing. When, like, I never could. I will never get over. I think in my day and age, from now, from now, forever, he goes and talk about a certain race of people, then he goes. Buy one after he talks about him and the person represents for him. Like, so when he uh, was saying something about uh, all the Mexicans were bringing in their poor and their murderers and doing their rapists, da-da-da. then he gonna get the little chick that was, oh my God, she could half ass speak English, barely. And I was really pissed off about that. And I heard a report that she got deported anyways. I, I'm, I'm not sure what is the <laughs> truth to that. The word, I love Trump. I love Trump. Oh, I love Trump. I remember that one, man. I was like, She probably wow. got 100 pesos. Yeah, I heard she got deported. That's That kind of messed me up when I found that. When I heard that, and I was like, wow. And then, like, for example, he talked about, he was talking about black people. Then he got the two, oh, I don't even, I don't even want to call them sisters. Like, they... The worst representation of anything I've ever seen. Them bitches? Yeah. I say it. Yeah. I, I take the heat. Yeah. Them. B.I. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This, this, that one right there? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The one that like Trump? Mm-hmm. Yep. The one that like Trump? Mm-hmm. That one. Mm-hmm. Them one. Mm-hmm. I wonder if you know what, though. For real, though. For real, for real. Hold what on. I, know, what I, I wonder if one was it having a dick in the mouth and one had the balls. Didn't ever think about that one, huh? Mm-hmm. Like he was just doing, mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, bitch. Yep. Yeah, mm-hmm. I'm gonna grab you by the pussy. He double. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he probably double fist the pussy. Ah, oh, I got black pussy. You know what I'm saying? So shit, get wow. the fuck out of here. You man. know what? I didn't think of. I guess that just shit wasn't rant. Now I can't put that in my brain, <laughs> man. That shit just don't. Why? Register. Why? Why? Cause Tell me why. Dude, I just seen because I'm not into gilf porn. That's why. So. <laughs> That's why. Look, and and and, and just ain't nothing wrong with granny porn. If her titties wrinkled, that means <laughs> I can't. I can't. I just can't. I'm sorry. What, I if the it. titties wrinkled, the motherfucking breast milk sprinkle. What <laughs> the hell is that? It's powdered milk, motherfucker. That's all that's gonna come out. <laughs> shit. Ain't nothing wrong with powder. just put some water on the shit. <laughs> See. You know what? He is the reason why I drank. I just let y'all know. Fuck what y'all talking. It's the reason why I always have a drink every show. Because of him. He the reason why I do this goddamn show. You hear this shit? He the reason why I do this goddamn show. Do you hear this? Because I'm planning on retiring. And this motherfucker say, no, we're going to do a show. Fuck it. So we going to keep going. So fuck it. He going to be a fucking alcoholic by the time I'm done. Because we're going to do three shows a week now. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Now I got to get the weed up. 
Fuck it. Have me some cocaine. Fuck it. <laughs> fuck around. Be like Rick James in this bitch. Nigga, fuck your couch, nigga. What's your Charlie Murphy at titties, bitches? Only fans page. <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm going to start plugging this shit out of all kind of shit now, man. Hey, just to let y'all know, man. Hey, uh, before he go any further, look down in the link below. Uh, this video. Yeah, to, look down in the link below. Yeah, right there. Yep, down. Mm, yeah, go there. Yep, down the link. Right up. Thank you. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Right there. Right there. Yes, please get <sighs> into the link. And, oh shit! That's the that's the one. And, and, get the one. That's. Whew. Mm. Okay, everybody, look into the link and please check out our um, other show, Difference of Opinion, which is way more PG thirteen rated and much more mature vocals, uh, speech, uh, whatever the hell you want to call it. See, my eyes is closed like I'm Morpheus looking for the one in Neo. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, I told you. I'm going. I, wow. I asked you, could I'm, I be PG? Uh, you said no. Uh, then you say be politically correct. I can't be politically correct. I see. Not no. on this show. No, nah, hell no. Nah. Hell, nah. that's like trying to put uh, Deadpool 3 on Disney Plus. <laughs> that. that ain't going to happen. That shit ain't happening. <laughs> Fuck around, be pansexual on that motherfucking shit. <laughs> I'm living a poly life. My uh, girlfriend and your wife. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, well, how much time we got left? <laughs> oh, we got like 20 minutes left in this hour long show. But check this out, though. Check this out, Joe. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Some, I was minding my business today, right? Oh. Okay. Why don't that don't even sound like that's starting off right? But go ahead. You know, I have an old computer in the basement. Yeah. Running Windows ninety five. Ninety eight. Okay. For real, real, really Windows ninety eight. Why I still got instant messenger on there? You know, I've never had a computer that was Windows ninety eight, ninety five, mm. none of that. I've 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 only been XPing up, so I don't. Yeah, I have a Yahoo miss instant messenger on there. Oh, I used to use that a lot. It got hacked a lot, too. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think mine got hacked, too. But somebody said, do you want to meet me tonight? And I looked at it like, motherfucker, I ain't used this in 10 years. Don't right. want to meet you? Fuck no. I just thought about that. Like, nigga, ain't nobody used messaging in a while now. So if that just popped up out of the blue, it's like, huh? Right, dog. So, you know me. Oh, God. You was playing with somebody. Like, you, you, you was fucking with somebody's head then. No, 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 no. They started this shit. Oh, I finished it. I know you just had them. Boom. So yeah. these motherfuckers are like, you want to meet? I'm like, how old are you? I'm 17. What you want to do? Play Barbies or something? The fuck? We can't do shit. Nothing. We can play checkers. Nothing. What? Hopscotch or some shit like that. Other than that, motherfucker, we ain't meeting nowhere. You know what? And I'm starting to really see. I've had some crazy shit come to my phone like that lately. And I am trying to... Now, here's, I have... Now that you said that, that's odd as hell because I ain't never had no shit like that all my life. And all of a sudden, between last year and this year, I have gotten a call like that. I have gotten uh, a random text out of the blue uh, threatening my life because I was black. For the very first time ever, I got a threat because I was... Just black. Just because I was black and I got a, a wow text message that I'm like, wow. First, they couldn't they couldn't identify whether I was a man or a woman because I wasn't letting on. Because they trying to attack and they, what is you? So I wasn't answering nothing. So they, oh, you're probably some dumbass woman and a fucking black chick and black hole in Detroit and, doing, did, 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 and got plenty of baby daddies. And did, I'm steady looking like, oh, you don't even know what I am. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, you don't even know if I'm a man or woman. Oh, you're fishing. Oh, you fishing. You just want reaction. Oh, man, I can honestly say I had fun at night, though. I, I I had fun driving a racist motherfucker crazy because I wanted somebody to find me. I wanted to give him an address out and everything. Like, please come. I'm looking for some fun tonight. 
I'm dude. Let me, f- come to Detroit, please, please come to the deep west side where I'm at and say, <laughs> please. I just want just hey, you know what? Do me a favor, KKK, one hundred. Hey, dig. I want y'all to march through Detroit, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. At night, okay. With your hood on, show you right. Your whole do the fire thing and all that. I want y'all to come through the deep hoods. Y'all can even get the little horses and shit too if y'all want. It's gonna be a barbecue in this bitch. We eating much, horse meat. Pretty much, I'm telling y'all now. Nah, I'm a man. I, I, I wish y'all thought this was the motherfucking 1930s again. Please come out and droves, motherfucker. This ain't t- uh. But make it sure, make sure it's at night. I want y'all to scare us. <laughs> you nigga, you know who only, only person that scared me at night? Um, Candyman. Fuck no. Bloody Mary. Fuck no. Um, Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> My bad. I didn't know where else to go. <laughs> My mama with a switch. Ooh. That's the only one that can scare me. Cause once you hear that, it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say something between that and that damn red fucking dodgeball. <laughs> That's in middle school. That right. red ball, you hit, you hit with that red, the, the blue or the red so, pill. So, no, as soon as you straight. hit it, soon as you hit it, it, it it's more like a wobble because <laughs> it's that wobbling go sound going in the air. Wobble, boom. Mm, mm, mm. Be up there shaking like Loki and shit. Did you hear that? Right, did you hear that? I don't know if we're gonna make this a YouTube dog. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Because this is this is this is. I don't think I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think, think I can edit all this shit out. But fuck it. We ain't. Fuck it. But you still going down, down in that show. link below though. Yeah, you still going. Matter of fact, you don't have to go. Call your girl. Tell her. He's on down to LA. Tell her to take a time with it. He's on down. He's on down. Up and down. Up and down okay. till she get I'll go up and down till she get there, then she get there, then she get there, then she hold just hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Feel the thrust. Oh god, hit the link, hit the link. <laughs> ah, thank ya. Thank ya. You know what? No. Here's a napkin wipe his face. This is not making YouTube. I know. <laughs> I didn't join in. Nah, damn it. Devil's advocate that got me into it. Nah, we this ain't here. Fuck it. I'm like Al Pacino. Um, um, you, you, uh, Keanu Reeves. I'm Al Pacino in Devil's Advocate. Oh, God. Yes. I ain't talking about a doctor's advocate. I'm the Devil's Advocate. You gotta go see. I gotta go see that one again, too. No, that shit was fucking awesome. All right, dude. You know what else I gotta see again? Uh, I ain't seen this one in years, but I gotta be honest with you. My God, brother put me up on it when I was like 18, 17. Boondock Saints. Nigga. Duh. What? Duh. Man. Duh. Now, I hadn't seen part two yet. I, I didn't even know they made a part two. It was okay. okay. It was okay. Yeah, that's, I, I didn't know they made a part two until Especially a couple of years Especially when man was ago. having a little fit about his height and shit. Uh, Duh. Duh. <laughs> Duh. He was laying next to a dead body. <laughs> <laughs> ah, man. I think my favorite part of that, boy, is when the uh, brother came down from the ceiling on the chandelier. Dog, man. Dog, that had to be the best part. I was like, dude, this is the best hit movie I ever seen in my life. Like, 100. That's got to be honestly one of the... I, it it would be considered not necessarily a hit man movie because they did have superpowers to a certain degree. Yeah. What superpowers? <laughs> okay, if you ever paid attention to the movie, the superpowers that they had was they can do phenomenal things only once they did those prayers. That's the reason why they could do the stuff that they was doing so wild. And they were just having a moment with Jesus. Yeah, that too. Okay, so I'm just saying again, they was doing. Powers. They was well, to me those are superpowers because bottom line was you ain't seeing nobody on no average basis doing none of that shit they did. Man, look, but I, I don't mean to cut you up. I'm a bad, I, and I, hey, I'm a bad man. I can't. Jeez, I saw that shit. Was like, <gasps> <laughs> man, I don't mean to cut you off, but I gotta talk about some shit that happened at work. Right? All right, all right. I'm looking at porn at work. Right? I don't give a fuck. I watch porn at work. Okay, I do. Every time I get a little five ten minute break, I, it, just go on, just go on. I like looking at titties all day. Okay, 
because I got this young lady I work with, and it's like, mm, no, well, straight. I look at her like a little brother. That's fucked up. Wait a minute. What? <laughs> you look at her. <laughs> you didn't even say a little sister. You said you look at her like a little brother. <laughs> look, I'm just saying, put your hand on your heart. Put your hand on your heart and just go down. So I look at her like a little brother. Oh, gotcha. Oh, wow. L- look like six o'clock. Oh, wow. Like an iron boy. <laughs> straight up and straight down. No feels, no thrills. Duh. She a female because she got a child. But it's not. It's, it's, it, I'm going to have to edit that shit out because she did subscribe to the show, though. But. Dog. <laughs> I am really going to have to edit this that guy. shit out. I don't edit shit, but I have to edit that shit the fuck out. Oh, this guy here. Okay, we're we going to cut that. Uh, look, you know, guess what happened to me at work Friday? Clap to us. I really do have to edit that shit the fuck out though. Oh my god! Wait, look. Wait, wait, let's sink it. Well, clap. Right. Now, <laughs> the other day I'm at work, right? And then you know I be watching porn and shit while I'm at work. Right? Yeah, I get a little okay. break. Yeah, it whatnot. <laughs> so, yeah. I come across this video. It looks pretty damn interesting. Uh, okay. I'm like, oh shit! This look really good. It has to do with panda bears or nothing today. Nah, I, okay, cool. I like the fur parties though, but no, no. Okay, them cuddle cool. parties, cool. cuddle parties. When they be just sitting up there hugging each other and stuff like that. Sometimes I just need to be hugged. Sometimes C- cuddle party. Yeah, where they just they not having sex, they just hug each other. Just it's a cuddle party. You just cuddle. I don't. I'm not with the. They're not with the dude on dude cuddling though. Well, hold some on. some are some do though. Okay, I, 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 go ahead, go ahead. What what the fuck you need a party to cuddle for? Because it's just a connection. No, I mean, I get it, but you can cuddle at home. I don't need no motherfucking party. What if you ain't got nobody at home to cuddle with? You a fucked up person. Need to go you find be. somebody. That's what I'm saying. A lot of people can't. So they go to these parties just to have somebody to hold them. Some people need to be held. Some people need to want to hail people. It's nothing sexual involved. It's just hugging. I get it. I get so, it. Some random ass motherfucker hugging me? Yeah. Ugh. And just, it's, it's, the, the dudes be like, come here. Like you was telling me about the uh, someone like to be eaten, some some like to be ate. Yeah, some like to eat, some like to be ate. So you know stuff like that. So yeah. I'm thinking it's gonna be it's gonna be one of them good ones, right? Okay. Nah, bro. Nah, it wasn't. It wasn't a good movie because you know what? You, you, she see her walking in. You know yeah. the little slow motion yeah. up from the toe thing. Yeah. Oh boy, like whoo. Right, like he a mechanic or whatever the fuck he was. He all like sound like, oh shit, boy, right? That happened. You know what? If, Hold on, let me finish. The beginning let me, of let me, that, I can tell you it's a bullshit seventies ass eighties movie. But go ahead. <laughs> no, no, no. Look, check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Then, then, okay, it cut to a church sermon. Huh? Why are you looking at these movies? What? This is not good. You should be repent for your sin. I'm sitting here like, wait a minute. I got to see my hard dick at work. Think I'm gonna look at some porn, then it just start up as porn and just cut to a church sermon. Wow. Oh, this is fucked up. Wow. You're wrong as hell. That's just I mean, you're wrong as hell. Yeah. You you caught that's me off just, guard. That's just I yeah. thought I was gonna get some in, some video enjoyment in, but wow. this is wrong. This so is, you know what? I have I have dibble and dabble in some porn, but I ain't never had nothing that rude. <laughs> that that that's just fucking rude. I'm just gonna be one hundred. That's like getting down in the middle of sex and throwing on some gospel. I'm sorry, oh, I have the nothing. Now let's say right? come on, cheating. You know, I have been debated with about with some Christians that were married that you can have sex during gospels. Look, I I, I get that and all, but guess what? It don't feel comfortable, not even to me. And I'm not even Christian, okay? I just don't even sound sound blasphemous, okay? I get man. I'm, a, I'm a, look. I'm gonna tell you the truth. I've been a heathen in my life. I have. I went to Greater Grace Temple and uh, ended up in the balcony. I was getting some throat, some giving somebody a throat baby. So that's why I'm no longer allowed at Greater Grace Temple. So I got kicked out of Greater Grace for a whole different reason, but not that. That's just. Wow. It wasn't doing service, though. It, it, but it was still in the building. 
Oh, I, even though I'm not religious, that's just so damn sacrilegious. I know, terrible, man. I'm so man. fucked up. That's why I think karma's coming to get me sometimes. Yeah. I'll be, I be praying every night, though. Karma ain't coming to kick your ass. Karma didn't come. Karma and came. Karma and karma in. Shit. Yeah, all them, all them people coming to. Yeah, damn, dog. Yeah, yeah man. I'm just. just wow. Like, wow. I got kicked out of there because I refused to take off my town. That's terrible. That, yeah. The people got mad at me because I had a funk that shirt on. Remember that one hit? I don't even know if it was a one hit wonder. It was a song called Funk That. It was uh, like it was a it was a real cheesy video. Everything he didn't agree with, funk that. And kept walking. He had a, like a trench coat on. It was just random like funk that. Uh, it was out it was like a rap. It was like a rap song. Not not like rap, hell of a rap. like hell of a hell of a. You remember that song? No. Hell of a hell of a mm, mm, mm. She is my favorite girl. It was a rap song, but it was like real one. I don't even remember who the hell made it. I know. Nah, looked that up. Hell I don't know, man, because it was just like, okay, it's just a shirt, but I guess. Yeah, yeah, that's why I stopped going. Then you know what? I was at, I was at, um, I went to Davis Aerospace Academy. You know what I'm saying? Because I was planning on going to the Air Force. Wow. Yeah, I was. Wait a minute. I thought it was gonna be astronaut. I ain't really no goddamn astronaut. Oh, uh, what Davis Aerospace was for? That's for pilots. Oh, for astronauts. Aerospace. That's all part of it, but yeah. Oh. Yeah. I wanted to be a pilot because I was going to go to the service and go to the Air Force. Okay. So. Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you know, since James, Gunn, since James Gunn put that song in there, every time I hear that song when Peter Quill was dancing, that's the only thing that comes to mind. These yeah. guys of the galaxy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was playing it the other day. As a matter of fact, I was playing it yesterday in the mix. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, but no, no, no. Look, check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Man, I was uh, I was going to Davis Aerospace. Yeah. I was, I was, even back then, I was a fucking ass. Yeah, we but know. I wasn't an asshole. Okay, I was an ass, and you know, what I'm saying we all we was a gang of asses. Duh. I don't even know how to take that. <laughs> it was a herd of asses. Yeah. Herd of asses. Man, we had herd females in the squad, guys in the squad. We just did dumb shit around the school. That's high school, ain't it? Mm, yeah, that's what I thought. So, the assistant principal, I got caught up in some shit. I got suspended. All right. She, she told me I had to come back with my mother and apologize. Ooh. I said, okay, all right. Did you take your mom? Did you take somebody else? I took my mother. My mother was there. I kept it 100. Because at that point, I was like in 10th grade. No. I was like in 10th, 11th grade. All right. No, 11th grade because I had one full year at Murray. All right. I was in 11th grade because I did. I dicked around from second semester of ninth grade to 11th. Okay. Uh, That's all the years I went to Davis Aerospace Academy. The, The assistant principal was like, you know what? You need to apologize. Okay, I'm sorry. No, I need you to read this letter and really mean it. Wow. I'm like, wait a minute. You asked me to apologize and I apologize, but now you want to make fun of me and degrade me. You know what? Fuck you. In front of my mother. And you know what I'm saying? That was like the first time me cussing really in front of my mother. I'm like, you know what? Fuck you. You're not going to degrade me, bitch. Fuck this school. I'm out this bitch. My mother got up. Let's go. Because I was not wrong. I dig that. Nah, I can dig that. And we end up going, me and my mother end up, that's how I end up going to Murray Wright. Ah. You know what I'm saying? So. Bombay starting to work. Huh? Bombay starting to work. Oh, the Bombay starting to work? Yeah. Cool, cool. So, yeah, that's why I end up, that's why I end up going to Murray and shit. Because uh, I, I, I wasn't going to take that shit. I wasn't. You know, I finna just disrespect me. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just trying to be as respectable as possible. Highly understandable. You know what I'm saying? Fuck me, fuck you too, bitch. Highly understandable. And I ain't using no grease. I'm just going to spit. I don't even want to spit. I'm just going in raw. You know what I'm saying? So, fuck that hoe. And it was because of the funk that shirt. Ah. It was the funk that so, shirt so that set it off. The funk that shirt and got you in trouble at school and at church? No, nah, no. Nah, the funk that shirt was just at school. Well, they didn't really care for me bringing it to church, but... You know. 
Still, it was my shirt. I went on. Um, oh, it, what was it called? Right there, Davidson and Woodward. When they used to have a little shop, about down from Shoppers World. Um, oh. I know what you're talking about. Uh, that little shopping plaza that used to be up there. Yeah, not the not the Henry Ford shopping plaza. Uh, it's still there, but. All the stores has changed, though. Yeah, all the stores changed. Uh, down where the Highland used to be at. Highland Appliance, they changed it to a little shop area. Oh, the little, yeah, 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 yeah. The little, what he's like, yeah, Highland Appliance looked like he used to be a Fredder's. Yeah, I know what yeah. you're talking about, right? So, I, that's where I bought the shirt at. Okay, I know just what you're talking about. You know now. what I'm saying? So, I mean, I'm not finna do that. You're not finna, you're not, you're not gonna derail me. Right. So, right. you know, it is what it is. I wasn't gonna, I'm not gonna play that. We, we not, we not finna do the disrespect game. Especially when I'm trying to be as respectable as possible. Exactly. Makes different, makes plenty of sense, man. You know what? And here's the thing, like in high school, that's one thing I can honestly say, your mother backed you up on. You were a young man and you were in the right. So bottom line was, hey, she had she had to back you up. Right. You know what I'm saying? Even my mother been on it like that with sometimes I didn't did shit in school. But there was a reason. Like, if I was Beating somebody ass in school, it wasn't because I decided to beat some ass. Mm-hmm. Look at me, look at me. Do I look like I'm finna beat some ass just because? Do I look like the bully for real? For real? Yes. Fuck you look, you look like six foot seven. Yeah. Okay. Three hundred and twenty-five pounds. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Straight, looking like uh, Dave Batista and shit. Damn. <laughs> look all violent or shit. Let's try about five. You, you look like a, you look like a mix between Dave Batista and The Rock, tall and violent. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was more like Cat Williams and fucking uh uh uh, uh the little motherfucker I can't stand. Who's a little aggravating motherfucker I can't stand? Stewie. Nah, I like Stewie. <laughs> um, <sighs> Kevin Hart. There we go. <laughs> Was it that look? Oh, was a different between yeah, it's between Kevin Hart and Cat Williams. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And the thing about it was, I was not viol- I was not violent in school. I'm not a violent person at all. Period. Nah, you're not. Not that I know of. I'm not. I'm. I'm like. I'm one of them people. I should have been born in the '70s. I should have nah, been. Nope. I should have been raised nah, in the '60s. No. Nah. I was like one of them flower childs. No. Nah, like nah. here's a flower. See, here's the problem Peace with you. Love. No, no, you too clean to be born in the motherfucking '60s or the '70s. You wasn't touching none of that shit to make them see the flowers, motherfucker. <laughs> I don't like drugs. Drugs yeah, exactly. is bad. So you thought the flower child was really okay. just? You thought they were just uh, peaceful f- for no reason? Free love. Uh huh. Free love. Can yeah. I, I didn't need my change back. Guess though. what? This is free loving. Guess guess what? The, guess what? The free love came with. <laughs> Here, free love. <laughs> no, yeah, for, look, peep game though. Uh, I was in Canada, right? Yeah. Right across the border. Yeah. I'm in Canada. Yeah. We just walking down the street. You know, a motherfucker off me so weed. I'm like, no, I'm like, and he got mad. The motherfucker literally got mad like oh, don't want no weed. Nah, I'm straight. Why not? You know what? Again, I don't fucking want it. Again, see you 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 be doing that open end shit instead of just saying I don't smoke. You want to make it difficult like I don't want it. Fuck that. Like man, you don't smoke. That's what I said. I said I don't smoke. Why not hit it? No, um, no I'll hit her, but I don't want your weed. Oh well. Uh-huh. Again, they friendly. Know. A lot of people are friendly, man. A lot. I didn't realize more, yeah. it's more friendly people in the world than my um twenty mile radius. So yeah, way more friendly, man. I, that's like I'm bust. You know, I'm busting up in the morning. Yeah. Well, 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 uh, wait a minute. You going to Florida? No, I'm actually I'm going to Indiana tomorrow. Okay. Then mm. I'm gonna make my way down to the uh to the A. Okay. Yeah. 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 We, we coming that way. Remember that. Yeah, I'm coming that way. Yeah, yeah. Hot Atlanta. Oh yes, you will I'm be coming. there, <clears throat> man. Especially in Sandy Springs. Oh my God, I hope this girl's still at the crib. Oh yep. my, half the team will be there. <clears throat> Hopefully, we can send some more reporters to follow Belly D and see if anything happens and transpires along the way. You know what I like to do though? What's that? There? I like to come on girls' nipples and watch them lick it off. I do. That's that. That's that. That's that shit, though. 
Especially when they got them big ass titties and they nibbles be touching each other like doop, 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 doop. then they put it right on the tip and be licking it off and shit I'm like Ooh, girl you are special special special. You know what? I don't even know what to say to that. They get their phone bill paid. Metro PCS thirty five dollars. What? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Uh, this motherfucker should have never said us sound like a black Howard Stern. So fuck it. I'm gonna t- I'm gonna turn that bitch up like Farouk and shit. Turn I, that shit up a notch. I, I see. I, yeah, I fucked up there. Okay. Uh, we like the APA of uh, podcast shows. I, I, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, motherfucker. I told you. I watch wrestling. <laughs> we the APA of the podcast show game. Okay, nigga said y'all. I just fucked him up with that. We did not expect the wrestling yeah, party to come out. I dare show that. Nigga <laughs> said y'all. This is what we going to do for a hot second. Look, um, I was just talking to my producer friend, him. What we going to do is we going to plug in one of my homeboys from back in the day. All right, this is some real hip hop. Um, this is my boy, Sire, right? It's some real, real hip hop and. We just going to go on here with the summertime joints. It's got hot as hell up here in Detroit. Check it out. Uh, hold on. Before we check it out, I don't know which ones. Was, which ones we, we Right on. We put okay, on here right we go. on. Here, here we, we go. go. Right on. on. Here we go. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Yo, you can catch me in the Aston, pushing through Aspen. With the head doctor, believe me better than aspirin. No, the feds watch and believe the hour the passion. Fast for the day that I leave them all in my back. When so fly little birdie as I shit on these devils. The same way I spit in the mic a mile above sea level. Same way I shine my light, red, orange, and yellow. GBI, victory and love the rebels. Industry say that I'm a showstopper. The streets say I'm a flow rocker. My peeps say I'm so ill because I'm so real when all I know's proper. Education always creates elevation, let's rise. At the square table popping delegation, just me and my five. Proper way to build a nation Start with me and my wives Fall in line to be the fall of all our lives Pray my ancestors protect and guide me through all lives Through all lives Manifested lessons in time Just ride on uh, As I'm rolling down the street Bumping the funky song Lay back with the bag of that cheech and chong Life's a trip So I just tell the driver Check Ride on You might catch me in the G5 Flying through C9 That's my cloud And be they puffing on that loud green line that's that knock me out, wake me up, type freestyle. Take the caveman back to the jungle, tell him be wild. We turn resources to the third world, tell him free now. Tell all, tear down the walls of the P now. Tell the guards that they are, who they been, be now. Tell the stars that they are, the future start to see now. The streets keep talking, he keeps watching. I swear I can feel these stairs, it stands my hands up, move with caution. Tell the babies that they are from, that's the meaning of life. At the truth table, popping observation, just me and my eyes. Even though you're a master of... Lay back with the bag of that cheech and chong Life's a trip, so I just tell the driver Check ride on You might catch me in the G5, flying through C9 That's my cloud that be they puffing on that loud green line That's that knock me out, wake me up, type freestyle Take the caveman back to the jungle, tell him be wild We turn resources to the third world, tell him free now Tell all, tear down the walls of the P now Tell the guards that they are, who they been, be now Tell the stars that they are, the future start to see now The streets keep talking he keeps watching, I swear I can feel these stairs It stands my hands up, move with caution Tell the babies that they awesome. from That's the meaning of life At the truth table, popping observation Just me and my eyes Even though you're a master of it I can see through your disguise Consume my lives with your cannibalistic appetite Roll up alongside you Put the ratchet to your mind Like you twerking your ass Back in the on the landmark Just ride on <laughs> yeah. As I'm rolling down the street Bumping the funky song Lay back that cheech and chong to each his own just don't take me out you never zone. see me when i'm way up in that mothership amongst the clouds hovering waiting for the right moment to come and blow your government who we eating is fake i hope you take your supplements regular exercise and sunshine the air they fucking with chemtrails we inhale lungs erupting metals in the air causing your mind to dysfunction peak and purple sunsets unnatural you love it like da 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 put out the ratchet and i'm dumping on the devil it was something they ain't tell you it was something that i smell too Oh yeah, fuck a reason in the air Handcuffed determination, you suck with me till we there I'm a very cool cat, but fuck with me and beware Just ride on Yeah, as I'm rolling down the street Bumping the funky song Lay back with the bag of that cheech and chong Whack-ass rappers, get on the mic Just give them a go Ride on 
yeah. As I'm rolling down the street, up in the funky song. Lay back with the bag and they get your own. It's all mine. I usually share, but not this time. <laughs> All right, all right. That's my homeboy, Sai, out of Akron, Ohio. I'm going to give shouts out to Akron, home of LeBron James. <clears throat> that was Ride On by Sai. Hey, that's one of the hottest hip hop guys I know all, um, out right now. Or I should say that I know personally. I, I like his style. And uh, blessings to the brother. Keep making music, bro. <sighs> Akron? Yeah, from Akron. Akron. Yeah. You met the brother. Um, yeah, yeah, we went to go get my stuff. The oh, brother, okay, okay. Computers okay. and stuff. Yeah, okay, cool, yeah. cool. I know some. I know a girl that's a zip down there. The college Akron zips. Oh, oh, my bad, because I was wondering what a zip was for a minute. I'm like, hold on, dog. How are we getting the drug talk real quick? <laughs> What? <laughs> That's why I'm like, ooh, how she how is she a zip? <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. Nah, but you know what I'm saying? I know a couple of people that's some, some zips and shit. You know oh, what I'm yeah, you know what? I really forgot that's what the hell they were. That yeah. was the weirdest thing when I was down there. I was like, what is this bull and why what are y'all? Zip zips, zippers? Like why? I know a couple of them that like to grab the zipper with their teeth. Yeah, I mean, I, I dug that. But God, yeah, yeah. some. You know what? You know what? Look, look, look. I love women. I love women. I love women. Yeah, we women. see. I love women. Women, y'all. I'm gonna take a little time out. I'm gonna take a little time out and say something to y'all. Here we go with the belly beat moment. You know what I'm saying? You just all uncoordinated today, huh? I don't know what the hell was that. That's not how that. If I got that all the way turned down, how in the hell is that so goddamn? It just overpowered me or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? It's weird. I think that's the last one. Anyway, yeah, that was weird. No, but I'm just saying, women. I want to tell y'all this from the bottom of my heart and the depth of my testicles, y'all. <laughs> I'm fucking looking like I'm trying not to. Like, dog. <laughs> you just stop. stop, man. I'm being serious right now. I'm being serious. From the bottom of my heart and the depth of my testicles. Without y'all on this planet, it'd be fucked up. I don't really get personal, too personal, about the people that I really care about. I talk about the people that I don't really care about. So. Shouts out to this special person that's in my life. You know what I'm saying? You're the greatest that can put up with all my bullshit. You know what I'm saying? You're wonderful. You're a very sweet, kind, and caring person. And you brought some of the most beautifulest children in the world. And I want to tell you congratulations on your wedding. But at the end of the day, I still was shit on your car. So I just wanted to just let you know that. Just, you know, what you thought it was going to be sensitive or some shit. You got you fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I have no idea what the fuck he's talking about. I, I'm just looking for some Smurfs. I want to make a damn pie. I'm Gargamel today. Don't ask. I have no idea. I'm going to tell you, he want to eat some Smurf. He called very women up under five feet Smurfs, and he want to put y'all all in one bed and make a. <laughs> For those that know me, they know what this sign means. Man, fuck this shit, man. I'm going to edit. This. I'm, I'm going to erase all this shit. And fuck it. We just lost an hour doing this fucking bullshit. Show, this show going on. <laughs> No, but all bullshit is sad though. I want to give y'all. I want to give the ladies of the world a very deep, true shout out that y'all are some great people. You know what I'm saying? Y'all keep us balanced, and even though that we don't give y'all the credit that y'all deserve, trust me, y'all deserve it. Not all of y'all. Don't get me wrong. Not all of y'all, but the ones that actually is there for us men in general, y'all deserve more credit than y'all is. 
y'all deserve more credit than y'all have gotten. And I just really want to be completely honest on that. Okay, that was the Belly D version. Now, nah, here go the face version. Hey, ladies. You know what? We really do appreciate y'all. And don't let nobody tear you down. And don't let nobody tell you anything negative. But you hoes and bitches, get your ass to the back of the line. Do what the fuck you need to do. But the real women out there, you know what? You work hard at what you do. You work hard to be women. You work hard at being mothers. You work hard at being whatever position it is that you are. Because just being a woman has a multifunctional task every day within itself. And you know what? Somebody needs to tell you that we appreciate you. And ladies, we do appreciate you. It's mad love coming from belly D and face to y'all. 100. So y'all ladies out there, keep y'all man tight and keep us tight if you can too. Hey, come on through. So, hey, mad love. 100. Uh, no, no, damn that. No, what? No, damn that. No. Okay. Summer's Eve, keep your vagina tight. You know what I'm saying? Make that motherfucker tight in a gorilla fist. You know what I'm saying? If your coochie got a nigga coming in three seconds, god damn, you got some good coochie. Because if I'm lasting t- more than 10 minutes, <clears throat> this is exercise, bitch. And uh, look at me. I don't like the exercise. I don't know what this guy's talking about, Dig. Let's say if that shit fitting like that, I don't want it. I don't want shit squeezing fucking. I want that shit tighter than coochie on prom night. No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not fucking that ass. <laughs> Black man Ain't no net ass here <laughs> Have you ever had a girl That had, didn't ha- that had a hairy asshole Had a bitch Had to wax her shit Before you run up in that motherfucker <laughs> <laughs> You know when you leave A motherfucker speechless That's how you're supposed To end the show So with that being said With that being said <laughs> Hell gonna freeze over And bust wide open When I get there I'm telling you Any shots out my brother uh, You know what uh, I'm gonna give a shout out To all the baby mamas Baby mama mamas And baby mama mama mamas And uh, you know what uh, I'm sp- sorry Miss Jackson Yeah Ooh. I suppose I suppose to give a shout out To somebody right now And I really can't think But uh, you know what I'm gonna give a shout out To Pam uh, You know what Do that entrepreneurship Hey Give a shout out To my children right now I got one that just won a scholarship. Congratulations to my daughter. And uh and uh for the other one, congratulations on graduating. So with that, yeah, love y'all. I just want to give a shout out to the sponsors that's continue to support the show. Uh Miss Michelle Davis, the author, you know what I'm saying? Uh truly special shout out to you and on your upcoming project. I know we said we was going to discuss your upcoming project later, so we're going to discuss your upcoming project later on the other podcast show. And this one right here. So I just want to get everybody shots out, especially to my teacher, my mentor, the person that really keeps me focused, even though she really don't like the um, subject topics that I talk about. Miss Michaels from Specs Howards. You're the greatest. You know what I'm saying? For real. Because, look, she, 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 she did some stuff, and it was had me in tears. Especially when she put pets and stuff, the little um, cotton candy Easter egg pets and stuff on her desk. And they'd be sitting there for like a year or so and told me this story about how the guy came into class, came into her office and ate one. That's been sitting there for over a year. So, and out in the elements and everything like that. So, yeah. Wow. <laughs> she the one that really motivated me to get into this podcast game. She said, I, "I have a voice for radio and a face." She said, "I got a voice for radio and a face to match and a face for print." So, <laughs> <laughs> shout out to Specs Howards, my man Emery over there. You know what I'm saying, Ellie. You know what I'm saying, Miss Michaels, the whole staff. I can't forget about my ace in the hole, Miss MJ. I love you. You're the greatest. You really kept me motivated, even though I was going through some dark times while I was going through school and everything like that. Shouts out to all my um my god babies, my nieces, my nephews. You know what I'm saying? I love each and every one of you. And the little princess, she she gets I don't see her too often or even much ever, but she steals my heart. I think about her all the time. Yeah, I want to give one last shout out to Diff Jones. And my homeboy Stacy, keep making the tracks. I know we got some more tracks to make soon, so I know y'all gonna come up on the charts. 
And speaking of coming up on the charts, oh, look out for my man Genius. We're working on new intro music for the new show, and we're gonna it's gonna be available for sale. Plus t shirts. We got new logos coming out. Um, it's 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 a work in progress, but bear with us. Everything's coming, just like me. After when you hear you, you hear your mama saying, "Oh God," when when she ain't in church. So, and I'm out oh. this mother lover. Peace.